um, Arch Palm 2.0 mini version. Uh, let me see if that one works. Uh, it's the Arch Palm Mini 2.0 Release Candidate 1. Uh, they're both pretty old, actually. I mean, this one comes from 2010. This one works. All right, that's cool. Um, you fix the other one. Uh, I have to put in some code. Actually, so it's not a problem. But I have to do that. I'll do that off screen. Uh, so give me one moment. I'll uh, fix the other one. All right. As I'm waiting for this to be fixed, um, let us go to the one that does work. Let's see what we got. We got uh, vanilla applications. Right. So we got some cool Bluetooth tags, which. Well, require some finesse these days. Hmm, never heard of that one. Cool. So we got some awesome brute force attacks. That's pretty awesome. At least it has a very cool um, like description of every tool. Like Zulu is a lightweight. 802.11 wireless frame generation tool to enable fast and easy debugging and probing of 802.11 networks. Enforcing web applications. So at least I can see here. Ah, uh, that's what we have. Like for instance, here uh, a Bluetooth stack smash fuzzer or just a device scanner. Um, without displaying keyboard for the possible security that evolved from using standard press keys. Right, so database um, here yeah, set of bash scripts for blind SQL, uh, SQL injection attacks um, to help exploit them injection digger MySQL injection takeoff tool cool actually has a lot of stuff for VoIP. It's pretty awesome that it has discovered HTTP low balancers. Definitely. Subdomain, and here you can see what everything is doing. So, this is a rootkit. Cool, we can fake upgrade stuff. Email content filter, that's what I already did a video on forensics yes oh that's awesome it's called boot, boot attack it has it in here in thumbs.db files there are a lot of extra information sometimes so that's pretty cool here you can make a JavaScript attack from PDF. So this is pretty cool that you can um, download a lot of uh, mail messages and just say I want to find I don't know password or something username. Yeah, this is some pretty awesome. Cool, it's new. I was gonna say, video is not. Uh, where were we? Uh, fuzzing. Simple protocol fuzzer, mistress. We got a lot of fuzzers in here. Look, there are some weird things on there. Oh, we got a war dialer. What is this? Ah, cool.
<laughs> Snappy can fuck network with no THP. All right, but anyway, um, as you can see here, um, there are a lot of uh, tools that you've made attack for True Grip Loader. Yes, that I know. It has a lot of tools. This one, I mean, uh, also a bunch of really specialistic uh, tools. Um, which you do not see anywhere else actually. Like this, uh, let down into powerful flutter, reverse radar is a domain scanner, uh, HTC, squ HTC squash is an HTTP server scanner, banner grabber, and data retriever. That's you know, that's pretty fucking awesome that you have all that in one go. I must say, this one is stacked with tools. I mean. Stacked with tools. So we got Driftnet, Packetomatic, plus it has all the uh, descriptions. That's that's something I really like as well. Uh, let's see. We got a bunch of tunnels. We got Cryptcat on there. Um, DNS to TCP is pretty fucking awesome as well. We got a whole lot of VoIP or VYP. Um, yeah, this is. I really want to get my hands on this actually. As in, use it. Uh, would be. Ubiquitous attack and connect toolkit. Jesus. RFID devices. That's still on here as well. Like I said, this one is old. This one is two years old already. So can you imagine things they could make if they were still around? Got the rep proxy. Yeah, why not? Cool. Um quite a fan of this actually. So we got at gap on here is a map, of course. Firefox, pigeon, uh programming data display and hex editor. Oh no. I'm quite a fan of this distro here. <laughs> 